This is Twit. All right, so we were looking for uh, alternatives to Adobe uh, Photoshop for our uh, caller, uh, Kevin, who is in uh, Memphis. And, Kevin, I'm going to tell you a couple of things. First of all, I have written down some choices that were given to us by the uh, chat room. But I'm also going to refer you to a website that I just love called Alternative 2. And the idea is that you know there's a program you want that it's too expensive or it, whatever, for whatever reason. You, you want to look for alternatives. So you go to alternative.to and you type in, let's say, Creative Cloud. I bet you there's quite a few entries. Now, this is a crowdsourced solution. So people have, it says, we have no alternatives for this right now. Well, maybe I'll just put in Photoshop. You said you want to do Vector, too. And that's part of the problem is you could get Photoshop, Creative Cloud Photoshop for 20 bucks a month. But because you also need Adobe Illustrator, now it gets more expensive. And in fact, you have to step up to a bigger package. I'm sorry, I've got the wrong one. Alternative2.net. I always do that. Alternative2.net. That's got all the answers. This is somebody just taking advantage of a name confusion. So it's alternative2.net. You choose the operating system, and then you can type in. So let me give you a few choices. I mentioned the GNU image manipulation program. And there's, a, a, by the way, an extension for that that makes it look just like Photoshop. And it does do vector. Um, I, uh, I'm i seeing uh, the chat room saying xara.com for gra vector graphics. Pixelator, P-I-X-L, or is it Pixlr, P-I-X-L-R. Inkscape, we'll put these all in the show notes at Tech Guy Labs. Paint.net. There are a lot of good free choices uh, out there. Um, P-I-X-L-R dot com. Pixlr. This is an online photo editor. Um, yeah, I, you know, for Windows and for professional work, this is a little more challenging. Of course, Adobe is going to say, well, we offer Photoshop Elements. That's only $80. And in some cases, that might do a lot of what you need to do. But if you're a pro, they kind of got you. They kind of got you. You're, they got you over a barrel. Because there really isn't anything that's as good as Photoshop plus Illustrator, in my opinion. Um, XARA is a commercial product. There's a number of programs on the Mac. Uh, Pixelmator, Acorn. I think, I think probably nothing is quite as good as Photoshop plus Illustrator. I'll tell you what, we're going to continue to collect alternatives. I do recommend Alternative2.net. We'll continue to collect alternatives, and we'll put them all in the show notes for you. Alternative2.net and uh, then the various show notes. Uh, and, I, and I'm with you, Kevin. I think that's very frustrating. Um, and Adobe doesn't really give you much alternative. They, certainly, they're right. They're a commercial company. They could charge as much as, the mar as, as they want. The question is, what will the market bear?